Howdy folks, my name is Lanso90 and welcome back to Let's Play Far Sky Quickly. At least that's the intent at least. Uh, we are very hungry. I'm very hungry. Let's get a couple of those bad boys. Let's get a couple more hunger before we eat that fish. Okay. So, we are to the copper biome. Luckily we also have like tons of new ammo, which will help us stay safe. What we need to do is, I wonder if we can pick up our extractors, because I don't think you would need iron at all anymore. That doesn't seem like it. It is true, though, that the game did not give us new extractors, because we haven't found... I haven't found a big pre-built base like I did the first time. I'm just going to leave that in there, man. So what I might need to do is just build a couple extractors before we go down there. To be honest, I don't think I ever built a base in this game. I think I just used pre-builds the first time I played. Oh man, they don't stack. That's kind of stinky. We see like the full map. Yes, okay. Could still be one out there, we just haven't seen it. So they want to go just to basically the way our character is facing. This way. Piranha. Hunger actually hasn't ticked up. Just seems a little odd just considering how fast the hunger normally ticks up. Yeah, I'd love to find just a pre-built base and just take that over rather than spending a bunch of time building a base. It might be fun, but I also don't know how to do it, so. Dang old anglerfish. Let's check out this ridge and maybe build our base up here if we have to. Uh, jellyfish are aggressive. I guess let's just build it here. Uh, if we can figure out how to do it. <laughs> or glass wall. I wonder if he needs to build like a foundation first, actually. Dang jellyfish are protecting this. Protecting this area. Maybe we can find some foundations and like these. I think we don't need any more floors. Also, I suppose there's a way into these wrecks. Doesn't really seem like it. It seems they're just like where loot spawns. Glass, pot, bean, eat. We should probably just put our extractors down. And then just come back and build our base later. So we'll just use this wreck as like a staging point. Trying to avoid this jellyfish that's chasing me. <laughs> yes, the jellyfish chase you, even though that's not how jellyfish work. jellyfish and just idly drift by in the ocean and if they happen to catch something in their tentacles they catch something in their tentacles that is scary I don't even know who you are 
but I'm not interested in finding out. Not interested in effing around and finding out. This has to be that this is like the hard, hardest way to get back up, huh? Keep going. Keep going. Just consider it prawn suit training for our Subnautica streams. Because <laughs> it basically is. Get out the big daddy drill arm too if we want. <laughs> okay. Let's see if there is like a foundation that we have to build. I'm kind of surprised we didn't find a base out there, but... That's the nature of random generation, I suppose. So when we go back out there, there'll be a decent little supply of copper waiting for us. All right, so. Oh, new base. <laughs> that might explain a thing or two. What the heck is that stuff, man? It's kind of annoying. I'm guessing we're going to need a ladder, but we got to go get whatever those crystals are. Are those the crystals? Those the, are those the crystals that are protected by the dang old... Octopus, though? Kind of want to leave some stuff behind here, because... If this goes poorly, I don't want to lose everything we own. Probably need all the construction supplies, though. Might not even need, like, floors and stuff, because if, if it has a new base construction item then I'm guessing let's see let's just grab some of these copper stunning spears let's equip them oh yeah that way we can go F around and find out what these uh, octopuses It's not like a very... Ah, crap, it's nighttime. Get the parts we need, though. We could just build a new base. Oh, we are way... Way off target here. Seems like this ridge is relatively peaceful because it's weird. <laughs> Probably because it's weird terrain. Might be able to chill on these ridges without getting attacked by random sharks and things. That's my hope, at least. Now, the big question is, is this, is this thing protected by... Octopus? No, it might be the other type of crystal, then. I mean, it might be, and I just can't see them, but... I thought we gotta go back to the base to build the base, though. It's like the, uh... Infinity Stones. We gotta use the Infinity Stones to create the Infinity Stones. In this case. Alright, alright. I think it was only two that we needed. It seems like a speedrun attempt is heavily limited by, uh... ability to build bases. Like if you get a default base or not. I don't remember having to build a base at all last time. I guess we don't have to. I guess we can make the climb every time we need to go up, but... And just use the same base over and over, but... Probably gonna get attacked by this one. No. Nope. Yes. Good shot, son. I 
And you're dead. Yo, you gotta drop. You gotta drop shark meat, bro. You can't give me no shark meat. Give me one. Come on. Oh, you. All right, you. Cook me a shark meat, please. And you. Is it the other goddamn thing? God damn. Oh, no, no, no. Are you not burning? Okay. Maybe I was looking at it wrong the first time. Oh. So we are going to have to... <laughs> yeah, we're going to have to fight the freaking octopus. Which are not fun to fight. At all. Seems like the critical hit chance only gives up like 50% more damage, which is fine. Okay. Um, so we need these gosh darn things. Oh, it's kind of crazy how slowed down we got by this, but. Again, I think we could just grab our stuff and go too. Biggest problem is just getting there at night. I'm going to have to use all my spears I need to kill the octopus on sharks. Swoosh. All right, all right, all right. hope this music has been copyrighted. This game was kind of before YouTube was crazy about copyright striking things. Very easily not be something they're thinking about, you know? Alright, how much HP do you think octopuses have? crits on that first one. Perish. No meat. You son of a... Oh, we are hunger. Okay. We did it. It did cost us all of our spears, but... At least we did it. No angler fish out of nowhere. Drop meat, please. Ouch. I'm bleeding. If I don't stop that, I'll attract all the predators from around here. I can make one of seed beads already ahead of you, son. All right, let's get back out of here. It's at least the easier way up the mountain. I mean, the bigger map doesn't really help since there's not high precision on your uh, character facing on that. Alright, so we'll go build the base now. We'll go down to our copper deposits, build the base, get the copper, upgrade our gear, and then we'll descend to the next floor. You are specifically between me and my base, as if on purpose. And 
room. Okay. Base, please. Finally, after 10 years in development, hopefully it will be worth the wait. Cook some anglerfish. Imagining an anglerfish probably would taste like the worst thing on earth. Cooked anglerfish. Okay. Spears. Do not know, but I'd like to save the better spears for later. So let's switch to iron stunning spears. Yep. Gonna say. Seem pretty likely you would attack. Running out spears. Gotta get to our copper miners, which are down this way. Except our map is very bad at telling us where things are, so I think it's over this way. Okay. Neronimo. Superhero landing. Stay away from me, jellyfish. Jellyfish might be the most annoying thing here, actually. The other stuff pretty much leaves you alone in the daytime, but the jellyfish are just kind of wandering around and go after you in the daytime. Anglerfish is kind of annoying, too. Okay. Stay away from me, anglerfish. I'm trying to do something here, man. Skadoosh. All right, all right. How does this even work? Okay. I understand now. be more than large enough. All right, plant some of the stuff. It's not on my character anymore. <laughs> oh, that was not what I had selected, but Trying to put on some more glass walls. Okay. You. Weapon workshop. Weapon workshop. I cannot believe we're going through all of our iron. That's absolute insanity to me. Could go grab our iron, though. Or our copper. There's probably a decent bit of it in these things, you yeah. know. Hopefully you can make a full set of iron or copper gear. And yes, for some reason, copper is weaker than iron in this game, even though it doesn't make sense. Oh, that's my uh, helmet. What? Gold? But there is no more gold. The thing is, there is no more gold. <laughs> I mind it all. There's, there's none left. Uh-oh. All right, all right. Time to go back up. <laughs> oh, 
That's a big old honking thing. Don't know what that is. Don't want to deal with it. Please. All right. Well, the game's actually going to take slightly longer than expected now. Then I think the gold would run out, to be honest with you. Seems like we maybe got a bad seed, because I think I had a lot more gold on the, uh, on the Let's Look At we did. So we're going to have to do some wandering around and looking for gold deposits. Which is going to be stinky. It also didn't help that we left our uh, seeds in here. Okay, give me the energy spheres. Take this manganese because we're going to get a lot more later. And now, no, I don't need ladders. I really don't even need glass walls because they're just kind of for show. In fact, oh no. Oh man, it just deletes it. That's kind of hardcore. That's a bit hardcore, not gonna lie. Don't need that. Make some stunning spears, which you might as well. So I have the copper now. Honestly, make one more because I want to clear up some inventory space. Um, honestly, remove the iron stunning spear because there's only one now. Keep the regular iron spears for emergency situations. All right, cook fish meat, shark meat. Look at the map. We're gonna have to go this way and see if we can find find what we're looking for. So you're gonna need two more gold as well. Just need lots and lots of gold, huh? Alrighty then. Let's go get lots and lots of gold. But we're all out of time for this episode. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, remember to hit the like button, keep the conversation going in the comments, and subscribe if you still want to see more. YouTube puts a strong emphasis on viewer engagement now these days, which is all the things I've just listed, so they're appreciated more now than ever, but they always have been. Until next time, I hope you have a good day.